Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak Pennsylvania toy collector. And sorry, my tripod's being a little bit fussy today. It's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. From the White Oak Pennsylvania toy collector. And today we got some Transformers animated here on the channel to review we got starscream and bumblebee in the house before we get down to transformations we're gonna see what these things can do they can roll very nice now for some comparisons with some other animated figures in vehicle mode starscream is less bigger than magnus because he's a big boy Magnus has always been the big boy. He is... These two are almost in scale with Optimus Prime. Why not? That's all there is to say for vehicle mode comparison. Let's get down to transforming Bumblebee and Starscream. Bumblebee is very simple. Like everything else, he is very simple. Down his arms... His hands out, straighten out his feet, and there we got Bumblebee in his robot mode. I'm the fastest thing on wheels, and no one's going to take that away from me. That's my animated Bumblebee impression. Pretty good, right? <laughs> it's I sound exactly like him when I do his impression, huh? And now we're going to transform this Starscream fast food toy transformer, which is very simple. I wish the legs would extend on my copy, but they're really tight. But yeah, they're in the same sky's scale as one another. Why not? Say so why not? We're going to do comparisons with the other bots I own. So I got to transform them off camera, which is what I'm used to doing anyway. Which I've done so many times, time and time again. So yeah, I'm pretty good at transformations, I'll tell ya. I've had it for a long time and I can figure it figure it out after a long time, and still remember, I'm just that incredible of a toy reviewer to memorize my transformations. We do a group shot in the back with all the Decepticons and Autobots we own as of 2023. So we're going to do a big group shot. I'm not going to do any more comparisons. We're just going to do a group shot because you probably know I have a lot of these. So, makes sense. I want to do a group shot of them. But this is going to be one epic group shot when I get done with it. And I got Ultra Magnus from remembered how to transform him with ease. Pretty big box we own. Here we got another version of Screamer next to that Screamer. Why not? But this is my Transformers animated collection as of 2022. Show off. We got Megatron. Well, the Cybertronian mode Megatron. We got Soundwave with the Laserbeak Qatar. Why not? 
He's ready to rock on and rock all night long. Blitzwing. If I can get him to stand. Come on, Blitzwing. Don't fall over on me, man. You're supposed to stand on your feet, man. You're not supposed to fall over on your own two feet. We got Animated Sunstorm. We got two animated ratchets, but I'm not going to bother bringing out two animated ratchets. I'm just going to put this one in. And two animated star screams. And this is my epic Transformers animated collection that I've been collecting as of 2024. And ain't it all impressive, wouldn't you say? As of right now, I've got one animated, two animated, three animated, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Transformers animated figures. I am missing a few more in the collection. Missing Lugnut. Missing Oil Slick. Missing Rodimus. Missing Sentinel Prime. The Dinobots. And we are missing Prowl and Bulkhead. But then this collection will be at 100% complete. But it's coming along nicely as of 2023. And I'm so glad to have this many bots in my collection. And that's all there is to say for this video. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out. YouTube land.